dia punya mana dia? Bagi Pia, bagi Pia lah Kita tekan dah separuh akhir Dan kita tekan separuh akhir Jadi kita betul lah Dan kita fokus untuk kerja suku pula Kita ada 5 game lagi So Pia harap Betul-betul nak fokus lah untuk 5 game Kita nak baiki keburukan kita jadi Pia awak cakap pasukan Lions dia pun banyak kali berjumpa dengan Lions kan dia bagaimana awak cakap pertemuan dengan Lions Lions sekarang ni bukan macam Lions sebelum ni kan kita tahu uh, Lions bukan uh, kita dalam pasukan lah uh, Pia harap uh, siapa-siapa yang main malam esok saya harap uh, main uh, agak uh, agresif sikit uh, kita harap kita kita uh, balik untuk uh, Pia harap uh, player yang main malam besok Buatlah uh, pemain uh, yang terbaik Di malam besok Pia ada juga orang Ada lagi pendapat uh, ramai Yang bermati Pasti pada kata mengatakan Pia sedikit off form Dua tiga game uh, sebelum Jadi adakah ia benar ni? Uh, memang itu tidak uh, Nak kata Tak off form tu memang Pia memang adalah sikit So Pia akan bagi Untuk buat yang terbaik lah Untuk pasukan Kelantan Jadi untuk penyokong lah Pia Sebab ni kekalahan ni Tempoh hari pun juga tak layak ke final pun uh, Ramai yang mengucapkan uh, penyokong Kelantan Jadi harapan Pia untuk uh, Harapan Pia pada penyokong-penyokong uh, Bagilah support untuk pasukan uh, Kelantan Dan Pia harap uh, game malam esok uh, Kita buat satu Kemenangan uh, untuk game malam esok Di stadium untuk Taman Matang Jadi bagaimana anda melihat Pak Yaki? Kita tahu bagi uh, uh, sebelum ni dimain dengan JDT uh, uh, Kita dah tahu sikit lah mana cara dia main macam mana Dia harap uh, siapa-siapa yang main malam esok Boleh yang terbaik lah Well we can't look in the past I think uh, it's important that we look to the future And uh, Kelantan is not the Kelantan that was last year that beat Lions Nor is Lions as good as they are uh, as last season, I thought they've lost uh, uh, three, four very important players, and uh, they did extremely well last year. However, we know that Lions always have good, energetic, young team. They play good football. They have a new managing fundy, which I respect a lot. One of the most decorated Malaysian player. I think uh, only the only one I probably know international wise. Uh, because he played in my country for a while. Uh, I think that it's a good thing for them that uh, Fandi is there and uh, the young players will look up to him and he's got them playing good football. Um, as for us, I think it's important to bounce back from our elimination against Felda. I thought we did not deserve not to go through based on performance-wise. They scored a, an unbelievable goal, which is uh, a lucky goal, a one in a million shot. But we cannot uh, be down because of that. So we have picked ourselves up. The boys have trained very well. Everybody is excited for tomorrow. And uh, they want to put uh, the performance right. They want to make up for, for the loss we had last, last year. So, no, last week. Last week. <laughs> yeah, I'm delighted to say to the fans that yeah, they've been pressure on me all the time to play Tego. But uh, finally, Tego has been able to train all week. So for the first time since he's been here, which is great news. And he's on the bench tomorrow. And uh, yeah, you know, I, I think tomorrow there's a big chance that he'll, he'll be involved, regardless what the score will be, because he's fit. We have Fakri back also from suspension. We have Mohamed Shoki back from suspension. So overall, we are stronger than last week. And uh, honestly, as I said, I'm looking forward to a very good, solid performance by Kantan. I think Fandi is trying to uh, play, maybe, you know, playing the under, underdog card very well. Uh, I think we should not uh, read too much into that uh, because Fanny knows how to uh, motivate his players and uh, young players are always hungry and they have full of energy. They don't need no financial uh, abundance to be motivated. So I think Fanny is more playing the underdog cards uh, quite well at the moment, uh, whether they fit or not. We will see what team he puts out and uh, I've told my players that we have our fans to please because everybody in Clanton is a bit disappointed obviously for not making the final and I hope tomorrow we can put down a good performance and play well and win the match so that our fans will at least see that progress is in making. I, I've asked this week in the press uh, not for sympathy for my fans but I've asked them to be patient with the players and patient with me because I'm here only five weeks and uh, I have to do 
miracle job to uh, to get this team back to what it was. When I arrived, there was no discipline, no organization, uh, there was no leadership, no guidance with the players. So I had to do all this uh, in in this short space of time. And I asked them to have a bit of patience, and hopefully we we would uh, win the game tomorrow and progress from there.